Hello friends, Tony here. Now in this video I want to show you how to upload multiple images at once. Because right now we just have to choose one file. Okay, so let's open the VS Code and I'm going to open the image index class first. And here when we have, we create a public property for photos, I'm going to say plural photos, which is going to be able with an array. And now also in the rule we are going to change that, so let's uh, cut this and I'm going to add an array and I'm going to say photos dot star, which means all in this photos array. And for that I want to apply this. Oh uh, yeah, that. So we don't need just paste. So I'm going to apply image. So. For example, photos one is going to be an image and max of 1024. Okay. Also, we need to change this one, the save method now, because here we just get the name, get the path and say image create. But because we have more than uh, one, we have an array of photos. Now we can say, first we can check if uh, is not null this array of photos. So I'm going to say, is not null of these photos okay if that is not null i'm going to make a for each for each of these photos as dollar sign photo let's close and then here we can say this name to be this photo get original name get client original name but i'm not going to use this one now because it's not safe but i'm going to use another one so i'm going to say dollar sign name to be equal with the dollar sign photo hash name like this and then i'm going to say dollar sign path to be equal with the photo and i'm going to use the same here as we have here, so just let's copy this and paste it here. And now we have the path. What I'm going to do now, I'm going to say, uh, let's create, we can store here the image, we can say just like this. So cut and paste that one in here. And now remove this and reset. Okay, let's save also, let's open the image dash index and we need to make some changes here so wire model is going to be photos not photo and also we need to add a multiple layer okay or not here i prefer to be in here so let's say multiple and here we check if we have a photo we are going to display to preview that but because we have more I'm going to check if we have photos. I'm going to cut this and make also a for each here. Dollar sign photos as a single one and display that in a temporary URL. Okay. Also, uh, here I have make a typo, not dollar sign photo, but now, because we have more than one, we can say photos dot star like this. And let's save and let's see on the browser. Also, I'm going to open here and uh, let's clean, let's delete this temporary and images. Also, I'm going to open the table plus. and delete everything from there and now let's try let's come here and refresh as you can see now we have choose files not choose one or choose files and let's choose two of them and let's say as you can see here is the preview and if i say upload yeah it's clean let's see we have two images here also we have images in the public and we have two images with the harsh name as you can see but of course if i go to 
people plus and refresh we have also here two images and now the name is hash name here and the path is in the images slash okay so you can see all of them now let's see the if i refresh and just say upload as you can see we don't have any error if i choose another thing here let's go to music and whether to choose uh, m4a say upload yeah now we have the photos field must be an image but i want to be required so if i go to the image index and here we need to add another rule not in here to say for example the required and pipe here because it's not going to work so let's try come here and that is not going to work because we this is going to apply in the single one not in the array okay so they just let's show you we don't have the error but we can uh, so let's go back we can add another a rule here so let's say a rule and I'm going to say just required for example here like this and of course right now it's not going to show anyone so just let me show you that's it because this rule now is going to apply in photos array which means in the image index bleed we're saying errors in photos dot all for a single photo in this array let's cut this and paste it down there and change remove the this one and now this is for the required rule which apply in the photos array which means it's not going to be it's not going to allow to be an empty array okay let's refresh and now if i say uh, upload you can see the photos field is required uh, of course we can change this so let's delete everything from images also in the table plus and instead of something like this i'm going to create the last sign images variable to be equal with an empty array and then here instead of creating here i'm going to say dollar sign images array to be able with and in this array i'm going to say name this name and path to be this path and down there we can make for each dollar sign images as image and then here use the image create and pass here the last sign image like this and it's going to work okay so we created these images to be able with an empty array and then in this one we added an array with name and path for all of the pot photos so we make a for each and for each of the photos we are going to pass an array in here with name and path and then we make a for each here and say image create now what you prefer now if i save we clean here everything and let's go and try refresh choose the files let's choose this one and this one here okay now let's say upload everything works good come here and refresh yeah we have two uh, images and of course if i see in the tmp directory and in the public images we have two images okay friends that's it how we can upload multiple images with the live wire now don't forget if you like such a video subscribe to my channel uh, like the video share with your friends and see you in the next one all the best